Hello, everyone. This is Zen. Today, I'm going to be filming updates on Quorum and Sologenic. As you guys know, if you've been following the channel, uh, Quorum has a two-for-one announcement this month. Uh, Bob has confirmed the DevNet and the white paper will be released same day in June. It could happen any day now. We do not know when it's coming, but it's coming this month. And I'm really excited and looking forward to reading the full white paper. Right now, we only have the blueprint. The blueprint has given us lots of information to start digging and putting the pieces together, just how big this uh, project is going to be. So I've covered a lot of what's in this blueprint. There's two things I haven't covered very much. So I'm going to be covering it in this video, the interoperability bridges and the decentralized applications and what to be excited about here. So let's first talk about the interoperability bridges with hundreds of blockchains currently being used. Quorum deploys a bridge functionality to interoperate, interoperate with various chains through collateralized wrapping. This allows for other cryptocurrencies to flow into Quorum's ecosystem seamlessly. The system of bridge, bridges will allow operators to create a gateway and allow for other assets from other blockchains such as Ethereum and ERC-20s to be wrapped in the Quorum blockchain. This brings a huge value to the users of the Quorum blockchain by allowing them to trade such assets on the decentralized exchange and benefit from DeFi functionalities for a fraction of the main chain. So that's really exciting. And they also gave us a clue here. The bridge system is fully decentralized and its development is based on the Cosmos SDK gravity bridge. So, you know, we've been looking into the Cosmos ecosystem and, you know, the whole how, you know, Cosmos is very important to this new system, especially Tendermint Core. Um, so you could see, you know, basically all these chains can interoperate in the Cosmos ecosystem. Uh, what I want to show you guys now is, you know, Quorum also has Ethereum-like capabilities with decentralized applications and building um, using WebAssembly, which is we scroll up here to Wasm. Uh, we believe WebAssembly is much greater engine for smart contract execution and has much greater scalability and support. It was developed by the W3C World Wide Web uh, with support from companies such as Mozilla, Google, and others. So that's important to know. So going back down to decentralized applications, since Quorum is using WebAssembly, it's opening a new corridor for decentralized app developers and DeFi applications by allowing them to write smart contracts with their favorite programming language. Quorum is taking the initiative to help and grow the Wasm smart contract developers community and as such has 10% of the total supply of core tokens designated for grants to developers. So my speculation is uh, since 10% of the total supply of Quorum is going to be uh, for grants for developers to build on this layer one blockchain, I believe when these projects are built, uh, stakers of the network will be rewarded with um, bonus airdrops. Let's say somebody builds automated, automated market uh, token on Quorum or a liquidity incentive token on uh, Quorum, then we'll probably gonna be getting more airdrops on top of the Quorum airdrop plan. So, you know, I think Quorum's uh, fountain, it's a wealth fountain. <laughs> it's a true money tree. Uh, this isn't financial advice, but uh, you know me, if you've been following my channel, I love money trees. You should definitely look at the blueprint though, if you're new to my channel. Uh, by the way, guys, please subscribe, give me a thumbs up. But if you're new to this channel and you haven't caught up with my videos, please read the blueprint. You know, they're doing so much with this layer one. I think this is going to be a huge, huge uh, successful project. Uh, we also have, uh, I showed you guys this, the Cosmos ecosystem diagram. You can see here just how much growth has happened with the Cosmos SDK, uh, with Cosmos the past, you know, past year. It's been phenomenal. Uh, we have crypto.com, if you didn't know, uses Cosmos. We have Binance Smart Chain. We have uh, Evmos now on. Like so many projects are building on the Cosmos SDK. It's, it's insane. So now moving on. So you guys have seen Mauricio post a lot. He's been really active getting the community together with Sologenic. Who is this guy? Well, I just found out today he actually has a master's of business and uh, administration. So, uh, I mean, this guy is talented, young guy. He understands, you know, the scene. 
And uh, I think this guy is going to do great in his role. I think Bob Ross and the Sologenic team chose really well. So uh, he went to University of Cumbria and also an art institute. So I think that works perfectly with, you know, managing NFTs, lots of things to do with art and NFTs. So he managed hospitality, hospitality venues internationally. I was actually, one of my first jobs was a lifeguard on the Las Vegas Strip, some wild times doing that. But uh, when I worked at the, in the hospitality business, you know, what I did learn is they take customer service super serious. They take it super serious and they're all about servicing the guest and making sure the guests feel welcome so that they keep coming back. So I think this is an excellent background and um, he's now basically immersed in blockchain technology and joined Sologenic to help the business development department. So uh, Mauricio is, make sure you guys follow him online. I'll show you guys the Twitter account in a moment. I posted this post and, you know, this is one of my most viral posts in a while now, but I said XRP reserve currency of the XRP ledger, solo turnkey tokenization and a decentralized marketplace and DEX. We also have core. We just talked about core multi-chain smart contracts using Wasm, interoperability bridges, dApps, so much more. Um, I thought this was a pretty cool post. Lots of people, you know, start to look into uh, core a little deeper after this post. Something else that's exciting. I'm still working on this project with Dope Darius. Uh, Sologenic community has reached out to a lot of the original um, Sologenic supporters and content creators, and you know, giving us opportunities. So. I got the opportunity to work with this guy to uh, work on an NFT OG club. I think this is going to be the dopest NFT OG club in the industry. The perks are going to be insane. Uh, the perks can be insane. So you cannot buy these NFTs. They're going to be rewarded for community participation. There's only going to be 111 of them. So far, I know if you're using the solo nation hashtag, that's one way to qualify if you're um, basically just active in the community, you're participating in the Sologenic spaces, uh, it will get you an opportunity to uh, win one of these OG NFT perks. And uh, some of these perks will be, you know, I'll talk about it more in the next video as we get more information for you guys. But this is going to be one of the most badass clubs in the whole entire industry, I could tell you that. So be on the lookout for more information on the NFT Sologenic uh, OG club. You know, Sologenic plans on having events and doing all types of big stuff. And if you're in the OG club, you're going to be taken care of. That's all I'll say. You'll be taken care of. And this is a way that we'll be able to remember you. <laughs> so I'm excited about uh, working on that. I'm also laughing because I used to have to battle all these uh, fudsters online who would always talk and try to, spread FUD. I don't even have to do it anymore. We got the Sologenic police now handling, you know, all the, the FUDders for us. So it makes me laugh every time I see the Sologenic police. So the community for Solo Nation is growing at a rapid pace. I've never seen a community grow so fast and it seems to be all organic. So it's pretty exciting there. So Mauricio's uh, Twitter account is uh, Z-O-L-K-I-L-L-A, Zolkilla. I think. And he posts, yep, that's me stacking core every chance I get in hopes of becoming a validator, validator one day. Core rules, eyes on the prize. You know, I said I would never share this decode on uh, Twitter, especially because, I mean, on YouTube, especially because, you know, TruthSeek33 uh, was the decode mastermind of this decode, but after seeing this hashtag eyes on the prize, it uh, makes me even more con uh, convinced that TruthSeek33 is on the money again. So take this with a grain of salt. So we're gonna go deep down the rabbit hole now into some decodes, you know, <laughs> that's what we do here at the Zen Lounge. We have open minds to all types of possibilities and TruthSeek33 showed me this decode, you know, eyes on the prize, right? But have you ever really paid attention to these characters' eyes? Most people probably haven't really looked and noticed that the eye of this owl is literally identical to the Corium logo, in my personal opinion. In my personal opinion. 
So, you know, I'm throwing you a bone. You do your own digging down this rabbit hole. Let me know what you think. Uh, this eye, to me, looks just like the Corium logo. It's even, you know, positioned in the same direction. We've been talking about that decode for a while now in the Discord. So um, <laughs> that's, uh, that's a fun one for you guys to go down if you're interested in those decodes. But like I said, guys, let's hope that we actually get a three for one. We call it a three-peat. Let's hope that we get the DevNet. Let's hope that we get the white paper and the tier one listing all in one day and really cause people to <laughs> have extreme FOMO once they find out. And who knows what tier, there's only so many tier one exchanges, right? There's like FTX, Coinbase, um, Binance, and there's only a few. So whatever tier one exchange they announce is going to be a game breaker. And um, yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's really exciting to be this early in a project. And it's really exciting also that the Sologenic uh, team is looking out for the community and getting the community engaged with this project. I think that's something awesome. Remember guys, this is not financial advice. This is simply uh, my research. Hope you guys have an awesome day. Please support this channel by subscribing. Uh, if you'd like to join the Discord, uh, use the link in the description below. Peace out everybody.